what is up you guys welcome back to my channel today is a nail nail monday and we have the anticipated release from orly for this is the fall 2024 collection terra nova love my orly color pass it's six polishes plus a bonus item Four times a year. I, I don't know. I don't know what else to say about oily polishes. I love them. I have a very, very huge collection. I've been a Color Plus participant for many, many years. Let's shut up, Jill, and move on. So this month, <laughs> you know what I said? <coughs> one of my, oh, excuse me, sorry. One of my videos the other day, I said I'm going to use One Night Stand as my top coat. And one of one of you left me a comment that says, isn't One Night Stand a, a peel-off base coat? And I was like, what? I use One Night Stand as a top coat. I kid you not, I've done it for, I never, I, I don't know. It is a peel-off base coat. Oh, Dum dum over here. This one over me, not you, not you, me. Uh, yes, so this month or this um collection, the a bonus item is one night stand, which is a peel off base coat. I'll probably use it as a top coat because it freaking works. I don't know what else to say. Uh, the MSRP for that is $15. The other bonus item are these fall decals. Um, I, I didn't open that. I didn't open it. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Come on. You can come out now. It's okay. It's okay. Don't be afraid. Come on. They don't want to come out. Um... This is, okay, well, I'm going to win either way. Alrighty then, that's done. Um, so here is the stickers. Um, I, I was trying to think of, they remind me of like, um, I, I don't know, I, it's a look, that's for sure. I don't know. Here, we're just going to put those over there for now. So, the colors are Starlit Shale. Shell? Shale. Bedrock Bloom. Earth Fire. Gilded Dune. Sky Stone. Rustic Root. Let's take a look at these babies. I was going to say biatches. Oh, I said it anyways. Let's take a look at these biatches. All right. Anyway, I love these boxes. Look at these babies. All right. Let me uh, pull them out of the box, shake them up, and get ready for... We're going to do two coats. I'll let them dry in between like normal, and uh, we'll look at... The end result, I'll be right back. I'm going to pull them out of the box, shake them up. Be right back. Okay, so I pulled them out of the box. I just wanted to show if you didn't, if you don't get the color class. Return to the Earth. Terracotta Nova. <laughs> anyway, there's a sticky strip on the inside of the box. And that's what the bottles stick to. And they really stick to it, trust me. So I just pop them off and then clean them with... A lint free wipe and some rubbing alcohol, and the stickiness comes off. Uh, don't use acetone. Heads up. So, Starlit Shale. Starlit Shale. I have a very large addiction to purple, if anyone knows that of me. Ooh, this is a pretty color. Gorgeous cream. Always with Orly, they are, look at the coverage and the viscosity. I do have a ceiling fan on, for those wondering. And it's about 70 degrees, and it's 
three o'clock in the morning. So, um, huh? One coat, and that is the Starlit Shale. I'm just gonna pop the lid back on halfway. <laughs> Bed Rock Bloom. Um, I do love purple. I think I what just said that, Joe. Um, but my second is like this burgundy um, soft wine color. I don't know why I wipe so much off the brush when I do this. Um, because I I messed the polish up. So um, I find oily polishes to be very self-leveling. You can leave brush marks. And as the polish dries, it self-levels. It's perfect. Oh my gosh, yeah. These two, these first two are favorites of mine. All right, number three, Earth Fire. For an orange, this is a really pretty color. Um, deep orange. Burnt orange. It's like a pumpkin color. Yeah, it's kind of a burnt orange. You don't have to be so sloppy, Jill. Let me, let me try not to be a total slob. I'm kind of showing you against one, um, then against my skin. I, I'm extremely tan this year because, you know, the war on weeds, but, um, well, that war is over. Somebody, the weeds won, if anyone was keeping score. That is Earth Fire. Up next, Gilded Dune. Now, I'm not a mustard, a gold, or this has a green shift to it. It's, this is a very interesting, I wiped the brush off, totally off again. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Okay, that, that's mine. That's my hair. I don't, this is not going to be a favorite color of mine. Sorry, I, it just isn't. I love oil. Look how much I can, how easy it was to fix all of that. I wiped off and made a mess and wait, there's still a hair in here. All right, well, stop playing, Joe. You know what, you guys, that... There's a hair. It must be wrapped. How about you just retire yourself? <clears throat> um, I'll be right back. All right. I don't know what I did, but that hair was like on the on my glove, and it was just a mess. So I just wiped the whole thing off. <clears throat> yes. All right. So. This is, um, definitely has a shift. I'm gonna... It, there's a green... I don't know if I can... I, I don't know. This color is very interesting. Can we catch the green shift? I don't think so. Might see a little bit of it, but... Oh, I don't know. Very, very interesting color. Not my fave. Uh, let's move on. Sky Stone. <clears throat> I have a thing for teal blues. Um, this is a beautiful color. And again, another oily cream. The viscosity is perfect. It's the same. Every bottle is... It's so the same. Anyway, the opacity, you can see that... Oh, look, I just brushed another hair into it. Um, it might be these gloves. Ugh. Anywho. Let's wipe it off and start over. It's nail polish, people. It's not, like, not building a hotel for people to live in. So, nail polish. Anyway, it fixed itself. 
Look how gorgeous this color. It's coming off a lot more blue on camera than in real life. Very, a lot more blue than, very pretty. I might even wear this color. I might wear this one in this, I don't know, we'll see. Um, and then the last one, Rustic Root. This is definitely like a, I wanted to say like a root beer color, but it's kind of um, a shimmery, really burnt orange red, red orange. Oof, this is a pretty color. Look, I just put another, it's gotta be these gloves. Or the ceiling fan blowing dog hair everywhere. Um, <laughs> rustic root. Yeah, this is a pretty color. Very pretty. All right. Uh, let's give these like. <clears throat> for you, it'll be a flash. For me, it'll be a couple minutes. I'll be right back. Okay, so I think we're pretty dry. Um, I switch gloves. Yes, I reuse gloves. I don't you know, work on clients or anything, so it's not like I'm, you know, causing major health issues. I reuse my gloves. I don't know. I mean, does everybody? I don't know. But I think it was, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what all that hair was about. And it was mine and not dog hair, so. So, uh, Second coat, fully opaque, no streaks, unless Jill makes them. See, like, I totally just foobarred that whole side up. I'm just going to come back, clean it up. <laughs> I'm going to put 17 coats on here. It'll... But I just kind of wanted to show you that it will, like, look how it's self-leveling after all of those brush marks. And if I tip forward just a little bit on the tip of this, it's going to self-level itself, even on the tip where I brush it almost completely off. Ugh. Orly, this is a beautiful, it's almost a vampy dark purple without being a vampy dark purple. All right, so, and this one is a Bedrock Bloom. How cute is that name? Bedrock Bloom. Kind of sounds like a stripper of the Flintstones. Ha! I'm kidding. I'm so kidding. <laughs> no, I'm not. All right. <laughs> Bedrock Bloom. Look how gorgeous that is. Oh my lord. Very pretty color. Two coats. Fully opaque. Wow. Yep. Oily. These are. I love them. I love, love, love them. I love, love, love them. Anyway, I'll sort up. Earth Fire. <clears throat> I'm going to show you something when we pick up the Guilted Dune, but this, the second coat really brings this um, orange a bit brighter, but it is still very, um, a burnt orange, definitely. Burnt orange cream, pretty color. It'll level off as it dries. Gorgeous color. I don't even like orange. These are all very pretty. All right, so Gilded Dune. I went to throw away the lint-free wipe that, can you see the green shift from now that it's dry? I think you can. Um, I went to throw the <clears throat> lint-free away that I wiped the whole thing off with you know, back in the beginning, and you can, it landed on the floor, and I was like, there's a hair again, is it, did it start in this bottle, what is going on, it's not Orly's hair, look 
come on. I, I have really messed this one up. When I wiped this stick off, it really made it uneven. So this is my bad, not Orly's. Um, what I wanted to say is, can you see the shift now? Green to mustard ish yellow I, I don't know not my favorite not sorry and that green shift is just odd there there you can see it it's so I don't know I'm gonna move on alrighty then um so this is the sky stone which I touched while it was drying. With the old glove I took off. So, my bad. Oh, was I not even on? I'm sorry. Did I mention it's like three in the morning? Oh, uh, Skystone. Again, very blue on camera. This is a teal. I it's very teal, not blue. I don't it's oddly different on camera. Gorgeous. Again, two coats, fully opaque. Gorgeous, gorgeous polish. Alright, this is the last one. A rustic root. This is a very burnt red orange. Maybe some copper tone in it. Copper tone? <laughs> copper tones. Wow. Yeah, these are pretty. All right, guys, what do you think? What do you think? Let me know down in the description box. Another six for my collection. I love, love Oily Color Pass. It is an awesome way. It's 36 It's less than $40 if you pay annually. I think it's $119. And again, don't hold me to these dollars. But I think it's $119 for an annual Color Pass. And that gives you free shipping and four color pass shipments a year, which is guaranteed 24 bottles plus bonus uh, one night stand, which is a base coat. And I forever have used it as a top coat because I'm me. And then you always get like a bonus, little bonus item. So... Yeah, and if you shop on Orly's website as a color pass holder, subscription holder, you get free shipping. So, go check them out. Let me know. Do you get Orly color pass? What do you think of these colors? Do you think this is odd? Or is it just me because I don't like green and or this poopy color yellow? Sorry, I said it out loud. Uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Uh, <laughs> give me a thumbs up. Helps with algorithm. Everybody knows that. And uh, subscribe if you haven't. I would really love to have you on my journey. Color pass is just one thing I do. Kind of crazy here. We got lots of things going on. I'm going to run. Um, I will catch you in the next video. Please don't forget. Smile at the grumpy. Bye.